Hey guys, we just got to Barranco. Got lucky, like another kind of lucky. This is the Airbnb place. This is the rooftop. That's all the area. This is like beach town and people do surf around here. I'm excited. We're gonna go check out the town, find some good food. Right. Yes, sir. By far, this Barranco is the prettiest looking Lima town, like the district. Close to the beach and in the center, they have all this historic buildings. It's colorful, it's pretty. Another thing that Barranco is well known for is their street art. Everywhere you go, you see all this art on the wall. Since we are in beach town, we're actually looking for some ceviche. We know exactly where we're going. Muye, something muye. Here. Gracias. We got this again. It is dry. Una cosa, por causa de ceviche. De pescado mixto. Mixto es. Todo bueno. Todo bueno. Todo bueno. It's less cinnamon. Mm. It's good. Yesterday, actually, I was drinking this so much, probably. And then when, I'm, I'm, I, when I smile, you can actually see my teeth already changed the color. And I was like freaked out. Then the girl at the cake shop told me that uh, it's okay if you drink water, it's gone. But still, I'm not for sure if it's like in the long run, if you drink it so much, it's gonna stain your teeth just like coffee or not. Up top here and down there, the yellow stuff is potato. And in there, usually it's salad or vegetable. And this one we order, tuna. Kevin even more excited. Ah, I got first. <laughs> oh. Gracias. Oh, looks so good. Now, ceviche time. We. And it's so funny again how they have this potato, like potato with everything, like, literally. So this ceviche comes with fish, shrimp, and what is that? I don't know. Squid. It's like clam. Oh no, it's like clam or snail. Where is it? Oh, taking the good one right here. Never mind. Mm. I don't respond if someone stole my food. That was a scallop. That was a scallop right there. Mm. The, the octopus is so good. I like octopus a lot. It's ceviche across the street. It's ceviche right over there. Oh, because it's just like beach town. The beach is just a few blocks away. It's ceviche area everywhere. And we're gonna stop ourselves with seafood like a lot because we are moving to Pisco soon. Which is like more like a mountain or. The mountainous. Has mammals though. Mm. Oh, it smells so fishy in a good way. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I noticed though, when like when they ask if I want it picante or no, I always want it like very spicy, like muy picante. But every time when they serve it, it's not that spicy at all actually. It's like more like sour. Liquid of this thing is actually healthy and stuff. They actually like slurp it, finish it, 
I could do it a spoon or two, but more than that is give me goosebumps. Goosebumps. <laughs> because it's all lemon juice and it's super sour. A little bit salty. Mm -hmm. But I love how funny I was asking Peruvian bebidas, like Peruvian drink, and the, the ladies suddenly say Inca Cola. <laughs> Inca cola. 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 And the lucky number. Ta da! 67 solis. And then tip separate. You guys, we're done. What this? El muele. El muele. This is like a recommended by some locals. We like it. That chicha morada. When you put that like a pieces of manzana, literally changed the game. The ceviche, it's good. It's really good. The fish is fresh. Everything is fresh, and all the combination of seafood, so good. That Kausa thing is my first time, so I'm not so sure. Like compared to other places, Kev said it's like really good quality of tuna, and he liked it a lot. I myself, I'm not a fan of potato in general. Like for me, I would totally not gonna be able to finish that whole thing myself. It's too big, it's too filling. I kinda like it, but it's probably not my most favorite Peruvian thing so far. My most favorite thing is that ceviche actually. I love this spicy salad with like the sourness in it. And I love raw fish, raw stuff in general. Also, we're not done yet. Come along and check out Barranco. Look at this one. This one is pretty cute. It's a cafe. In the train. We're walking out. <laughs> that is Barranco Starbucks. Yeah, this is Barranco KFC. Speciale. Yeladeria. Wow, this looks quite fancy. Por favor. Gracias. Can I try turon, por favor? Yes. Can I try please, por favor? Gracias. I got two flavors. One is toro, the other one is coco for sure. But I'm not sure what is that bit in the coco. I think it's like a roasted coconut meat. Yeah. If I needed a job like a guy, you might as well with all women, so like next thing you know you're banging them all. Totally the fanciest ice cream shop I've been to yet. Literally. <laughs> Over to the beach. That's the town. Nice little shop over there. The waves are strong. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed Barranco, my favorite place so far in Lima. We're gonna be here in this town, Barranco, one more day, like one and a half day before we have such a long bus ride to Arequipa. The next month, for sure, we're gonna go for more service because this is going to be our last chance to 